Maya here with that hashtag show here at Comic Bug, where we'll be interviewing with Caitlin Diaz, the Hello. voice actress of Riley from Inside Out. How are you doing today? I'm doing great. Awesome. Awesome. So tell me, when was it when you started to realize that acting was something you wanted to do? Well, it started way back in elementary school. Mm -hmm. I'd done a couple of school plays and I was like, I have a lot of fun doing this and I'm able to help make people's day and make them smile. So it was a win-win for me. You know that, that good feeling that you get when you make someone else feel good? It's, oh, yeah. It's that the whole th the whole time of the show. That's cool. What was the most exciting part of it? Like, because I knew you got to work with a lot of neat actors and actresses. Or do you even get to engage with all the actors? I actually did not. It, oh, Usually wow. with uh, animation, it's mm -hmm. just one person in the booth at a time. Mm -hmm. They took people who were in totally separate time zones most of the time mm -hmm. and it made it so that so that it seemed like they were talking directly to each other and bouncing off of each other. How about the emotions when you had to switch back and forth from sad to joy or did they do it just one shot where you do all your sad emotions at once and your joy emotions at once or was it a lot of back and forth? Uh, they tried to make it gradual shifts to make it easier for me which I definitely appreciated mm -hmm. especially with some of those scenes it's I do really get into uh, into a certain headspace for it. Mm -hmm. Like uh, at the end, uh, sorry, I'm not going to give any spoilers, but I have to really bring home the emotions and bring out the tears. Right. And without even trying to, I was crying in the studio. And that made my mom cry because she's like, oh my God, my baby's crying. I need to do something. <laughs> I know. Mother, I... mother instincts kicked in. Hi, guys. We're here with Cheryl Diaz, the mother of the real Riley from Inside Out. So tell us, how is it? Like when you got that call, what was your reaction towards it? I was shocked actually because she had auditioned probably six to nine months before that. Mm -hmm. And so we thought the part was already gone. Right, you already passed the heart. Like, yeah, yeah so God, when she worry. got it, I was yeah. like, oh my gosh, I can't wait to go pick her up from the school. This is killing me. How awesome. You're going through traffic and everything. Else. <laughs> yeah. What did you do when your mom called you and said, you got this role? What did you do at that moment? I was like, what? <laughs> Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I was bouncing up and down in my seat because I'd just gotten into the car after mm -hmm. school. Right. And I was just like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. And I almost wanted to run out and run around the school screaming it. <laughs> so cool. I want to get to know the real you. So tell us what got you into this lifestyle. Who got you into comics? It had to start with my dad because he is a big Star Wars and Star Trek fan. Mm -hmm. Star Wars. <laughs> and. Through him, I discovered the whole world of sci-fi, and I was just like, whoa. Because this is stuff that is that might one day come true, we might be able to do. So just the possibility of that, it just blew our mind. And I, and I was just so into it. And it's, it was just something so amazing to me that I really wanted to get into it. And through that, I discovered other things like, like a fantasy and so on and so forth. Uh -huh. And it's just, my dad was the one who definitely opened the door. That's so cool. Let's see what we got here. Ooh, Catwoman. I'm a big cat fan. Oh, let's see. Let's see. Let's see what else we have here. There's a lot of Star Wars, Star Trek, ooh, and Doctor Who. I love Doctor Who. Wait. Is this Batman manga? Hmm. That's something new I haven't seen before. Deadpool, of course. Oh my god, he's got a chimichanga truck. Yes. Yes, finally. Black Widow. You don't see her much, unfortunately. Black Widow. Oh my god, they got Buffy. They got Buffy. They got Buffy. Buffy. Oh my god, they have an Edward Scissorhands comic. <gasps> Never know. Never know what you're gonna find. I really want to say thank you for taking the time to meet with us here at Comic Bug, which, you know, very supportive to our channel. Again, everybody, thank you. Don't forget to subscribe where everything is trending in geek pop culture. Thank you. How you doing? Guardians of the Galaxy. Yeah. All right, and at the comic bug, you get free bags and boards with every purchase. Yeah. <laughs> Ding! There you go. Features is good quality. That's and to get you, can I get your autograph? Um, Graham yeah. It's worth way more than that. We just took them in July, June or July. Uh, for their cool, thank you, Caitlin. They went there on their hey, don't be a stranger, come back and see us. And so we'll do.